What's up, guys? Guess what? Walmart. So, of course, I'm here to check out the new knives. Let's see. So, we do have something new from Swiss Tech. A little fixed blade, it looks like. 35 bucks. Cool, cool. I see Civivi. That's what I was here for. Just to see what they had. I don't know why this one's just out of the box here. Um... Interesting though. That's all I see. Hmm. Is that really it? <laughs> it's the same old stuff here. No, another Civivi. Just randomly. Oh, another Civivi. There we go. Okay. Is that right? Fifty-one dollars. Which which version is that? Ooh. Hmm. Okay. Oh, another Swiss Tech. So they're popping up. I'm just 50 bucks. Just took me a minute to see it, I guess. Hold on. Got a mad glare going on here. So what is this one? Focus. The glare is too much. The Vulcan. Alright, so 50 bucks. This one has looks like some kind of a axis style lock on it. Interesting. Hmm. Crossbar lock. And ball bearings. Low profile flipper. We got a blade steel in here. Hmm. Okay. Interesting. Um, let's see. It was our trail. Super exciting. Yeah, just kind of la di da. Let's see if I'm missing anything else. Hang on. All right. Um. Yeah, no. All right. So we have the brazen. It's forty nine twenty eight. I was looking for price tags. What we got down here? The Praxis is twenty nine seventy seven. I mean, you know, it's kind of cool, like I said, seeing more familiar stuff, uh, a wider variety, you know, at Walmart. It's usually the same stuff in this case, but yeah, I mean, it's, you know, it's a little underwhelming. I mean, the Balkan, I'd love to try out. I think that'd be cool. Um, what else? Uh, no, I'm just kind of looking. Thank you. Looking at all the, the new stuff you got in the way of knives. Do you have knives anywhere else besides this case? That's it, in the little. Oh, okay. All right, I'll go check those out. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hmm. Uh, not sure how big this is. As you guys know, I love my neck knives. Can't miss my quota. Move off the side. Mm. Okay. I mean. I don't know. It's hard to tell if I can rock that as a neck knife or not. Alright. Let's go check out camp stuff real quick. Let's see if for some reason there's more stuff over there. But I kind of doubt it. Like I said, I don't know. It seems a little underwhelming. Eh. I don't think I've seen this before. It looks a little hokey. I do like, and they're, they're not the first person to do this, by the way, to put a ferro rod in the frame of the knife. Gotta have the bottle opener. The strap cutter is gimmicky to me. The ferro rod in the back is, it's kind of cool, I guess, on the right knife, you know, that you can actually use out in the woods, maybe. Eh. Eh. Yeah, I, guess, I don't know. I guess that's about it. That's... Womp womp. It was nice to see new stuff, but I don't know what I was expecting, <laughs> to be honest. I, I kind of wanted to check out more of the Swiss Tech stuff. I did see a model, I can't think of what it was off the top of my head, but someone sent me that they got that looked awesome. Um, I don't think it was the Balkan, but yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. So that's all. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have a wonderful day. 
and I'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video. Take care.